Vlog day, 470. In the meantime, good morning. Oh, 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 come on, buddy. Stay with me. We are, uh, ooh, it's kind of rainy outside. At least like, it looks like it was. Which means it's time to wear the rain jacket. One hood up. One hood under. That could be their new theme song. You can have that one. I'm gonna be going to get some coffee. Uh, it, it was falling behind today, right? In the, the, the daylight saving sense, so got an extra hour of sleep. I wish there were 25 hours in every day, because that would be amazing, unfortunately. Only happens once a year. So, I'm gonna go grab some coffee. I gotta start my laundry, and today, I'm gonna do a bit of a reflection vlog, because I was out pretty late, didn't get the old vlog edited. I'm working on it right now, but I also haven't eaten anything. Really hungry, so we're gonna take care of those things, and I think today we're gonna do a little bit of a reflection vlog, because my plan is actually basically to camp out here, uh, to get the postcards done, get this edited. I'm just gonna try and nail a few things. Uh, if you're not if you're not sure what I'm talking about, is that a plane? If you're not sure what I'm talking about when it comes to the postcards, I am of course referring uh, to these. My favorite one I think, I don't know if I'm allowed to have a favorite or if it's wise to tell you, but just the way this one turned out is killing me. I absolutely love it. So I'm gonna fill these out, send them to you patrons. You, you can, this is the only time you're ever gonna see that. The stamp is gonna go on top of that and you'll probably never see it again. But yeah, I'm gonna work on these. This is gonna actually take me a long time to do all these. Uh, and I just kinda wanna chill here today. Fraser's like fifth going away party is tonight. You saw him last night in the vlog when we were being attacked by zombie demons. Be sure to subscribe to him if you haven't, if you're interested in his stuff. He's just a really fun guy. And uh, unfortunately, he's leaving us. Again, he has some really interesting stories with that, but you'll be able to travel with him via YouTube if you hang out with him. So that is that. I'm gonna go ahead and start answering questions on the go, because I guess we'll start with laundry. I guess we'll take, uh, we'll start with laundry. Question one, what did I set out to accomplish this week? Did I accomplish it? And how do I feel about it all? Well, I, uh, I thought I was setting out to be antisocial this week. That did not happen, so that's, that absolutely did not happen. This is like the most social week ever, but I feel great about it. It was good to see Jess, Pat, seeing Fraser off. I hadn't seen Fiona in a really long time, so it was really, really neat to get to see a bunch of people. It's great, my landlady, Kiki, it's good to see her as well. So just lots of, uh, lots of good social time. Leading into what will be an incredibly antisocial week. Unsocial, not antisocial, you know what I mean. I'm just not gonna, I'm just not gonna be social. That's my plan. <laughs> Dang it! You decide it's closed. I was banking on those guys. There's the only good coffee in my neighborhood. Second question. What French word or phrase did I learn this week? Fuite. Une fuite. Uh, I didn't know the word for a leak. I knew couler, uh, which is a verb that things are leaking, but une fuite is to like have a leak in a glass or something like that. I know it's not a very exciting word, but that's one of the words I learned. I learned another word last night, um, but I haven't really put any thought. Uh, Oh, I taught the word hobble to some French people last night, but uh, immobiliser, I think, is the best translation for to hobble, uh, but it's not a very good one. Like to hamstring or to hobble? Hobbling, of course, being completely different because you hobble like the foot of a horse or whatever and hamstring, you know, but you get the idea. How do I feel about my current status settling in France? Unsettled. Uh, but that's, that's, that's not gonna change. Still a limbo. Still in limbo. I'm still, I'm still bouncing around with a couple of pieces of paperwork that make absolutely no sense. Did I write this week and what in? I kind of wrote this week in Agnar's box. I actually spent a lot of time hacking away at Agnar's box, deleting something in the range of like 15,000 words, I think, which is pretty good. Uh, and like I said, I think I've still got another five to 10,000 words to shred, and then we'll be ready to fill some of it back in, and hopefully we're off to the races. Oh. Put my hand right in bird poop. Oh, a lot of it. Okay, well, anyways, I didn't realize that my horizon was off until after I'd already let this go for a while, so whoops. Did I enjoy vlogging this week? And what could I have done to improve the vlog? I did enjoy vlogging this week. It's been fun. It's interesting because, especially with the mix-ups of scheduling, as things change, like with my 
work, job side of stuff as they get prepared for other things. Like just a lot, feels like there's a lot going on. It makes it really difficult to, it makes it, it, makes it feel like it's a little bit um, out of whack, but I think it's been fun. I think it's made some different, some big changes. Uh, so I think, I think it's been fun. I think it's forced some changes naturally into the format of the vlog, but I think that it's been really fun I, and I'm mostly enjoying it. I don't enjoy getting bird poop on my hands, but that's the price you pay to get a good spot uh, that you have to climb up to to get, you know, a shot of the Eiffel Tower. Anyways, back to my drag. <laughs> Sleep, exercise, and social life. Sleep, terrible. Uh, social life, awesome. Way too much, but awesome. Exercise, meh. And okay, I think this is my like. I think this is my third run of the week. I don't know, I'm really sure about that though. Uh, yeah. So, meh. also not the most intense run that I'm doing right now, but I'm a little bit tired from the week, so just kind of making sure to get out and get some mileage. That's the goal. Um, yeah. <laughs> And we're back. As for whether I did anything I'm particularly proud of or that was mildly embarrassing or uh, whether or not I called my mom. I'm gonna call my mom uh, here in a minute because I haven't talked to her this week. This is a good reminder that I really need to call her. Uh, so I'm gonna do that. I'm feeling fairly accomplished because I've got that many postcards filled out, but I still have this many to go. So we got a ways to go. If you haven't gotten your postcard yet, it's because I haven't sent them yet. Theoretically, it should only take a couple of weeks to get to you once I send them, so I'm hoping to get them sent out this week. I am up to 69 patrons, which leaves us with six unclaimed postcards. So if you want to jump on Patreon, now's your chance. This is it. This is what it comes down to right here. So obviously that will be linked below, as always, and at the end of the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe. Uh, it, there, there's a, a sign behind the camera reminding me to tell you that. Yeah, that's basically it. I need to eat something because I've only had one food today, and it's definitely three foods late. So, there are three foods into the day. One of those things. So, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'm gonna go to Fraser's going away party. Don't know that I'm gonna film anymore today. I think I might just leave the camera off at that point, but you never know what's gonna happen. So, hope you enjoyed today. I will see you again tomorrow for a very Monday Monday.